fellas on the coach? They all arrived. Not yet. Morning, everybody. Buongiorno, everybody. <laughs> what is all this? It's beer. We are not driving, so we can be drinking. Hey, should we have the first one now? No, we won't have the first one now. Look, please get on the coach, everybody. We can't. Why not? They've only sent one coach. He's caught us in and out, sorting it out. What did the man say, Miss Courtney? The man said you only ordered one coach. It's not true. I definitely ordered two coaches. Typical male inefficiency. <laughs> no problem. Yes, we're a coach missing. Can't they send one round? They haven't got another one. They're fully booked. What are we going to do? Oh, I, I can get you a coach. Could you see it? Yeah, my brother-in-law, he's in the coach business. He lets it out for outings and old age pensioners. I drive for him in my spare time. Would you like to go and bring him, Sydney? Oh, don't worry, I'll pop round the corner. It's not very far. I'll be back in ten minutes with a cockroach. And what? With a coach. Oh. <laughs> Stop this at once! Please! I expect they're anxious to get started. <laughs> Look, why don't you get going and we'll follow on as soon as Sid arrives. What a good idea. Now, Mrs. Hunter, will you get on the bus? Allow me. Oh, thank you. All right. Miss Courtney? No, I'm not going. Ah, you've changed your mind. <laughs> no, I am going on your coach with you. hasn't arrived yet. We are being okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> we are, Mr. Mark. Hey, you got some beer as well. Ah, why don't we have a drink now? It's a good idea. Oh. It is not a good idea at all. This is supposed to be an educational trip, not a tippler's tour. <laughs> <laughs> Here we are. Is this the best you can do, Sid? Don't worry, she's very comfortable. Just like riding on a cushion of air. <laughs> Stop what? <laughs> Drawing lots will decide who will sit next to who. All right? So I want you to write your names on these pieces of paper I'm giving you, and then we will put them in the waste paper basket and draw them out one at a time. Like whole bingo. <laughs> uh, similar to bingo, yeah. Don't forget to write your name. No, I won't, Danielle. <laughs> right, everybody finished? Yeah. Right, now fold them up and uh, put them in here. Oh. And this time, when I draw them out, that will be final. I don't want any more arguments. Is that understood? Yeah, no. Good. Right. Everybody ready, then? Ingrid, uh, will you give them a shake for me, please? Yeah, I shake it for you. <laughs> Is going to be the lucky one to be getting me? <laughs> Ranjit. <laughs> Can you please be starting again? <laughs> no, it's a perfectly fair system. In any case, it's time you two learn to coexist. Oh. Max. If the next name is Giovanni, I'm not going. <laughs> and, on second thoughts, I'd rather have Giovanni. <laughs> When we get on coach, you and me will sit at the back, okay? We sit at the front, and no funny business. <laughs> Danielle? Please, let it be me. <laughs> Zoltan. Santa Maria. <laughs> uh, you will sit next to Danielle on the coach. <laughs> ah, thank you. It's all right. <laughs> Taro? Also. Jamila? Happy to sit next to you. I am also most happy to be sitting next to you. Ingrid? 
That's all, please, me. Juan! <laughs> Giovanni! Oh, it's got to be Sully or you, Professori. Sully. But who are you to be sitting next to, Professori? Come along, everybody. <laughs> I am thinking we are lost. We are not lost. Now, where are we, Sid? I don't know. You had the map. You were doing the navigating. Well, I couldn't read it in that old bone shaker of yours. It kept jiggling up and down. Then you should have jiggled up and down with it. We are not <laughs> definitely lost. I'm not lost. We're just not where we should be. Well, perhaps you could show us where we should be. Well, I know where we should be. I just don't know where we are. <laughs> we are. <laughs> Look, we passed a sign just down the road. Now, did anybody see what it said? Yes, please. Right, well, I'll look it up on the map, and then we will know where we are. I really don't think that would be much help, Mr. Brown. With all due respect, Miss Courtney, I happen to possess a Pathfinder's badge from the Boy Scouts, so I know quite a bit about the map. <laughs> Once I know what the sign said, it's a simple matter to find out our exact location. Now, what did the sign say? Cattle crossing. Yep. <laughs> find that on the map, Mr. Brown. I'm telling you, we are lost. If you don't shut up, you'll be lost, because when we move off, we'll abandon you. Well, I suggest we carry on until we get to a main road. There's bound to be a signpost. Good idea. Right, start her up, Sid. All right. right come on, everyone. Finish your drink, please. Leaving. Now, what's the matter? Well, it sounds to me as if the engine won't start. That is patently obvious. Oh. The engine won't start. <laughs> Why won't it start? Well, hang on a minute, we'll find out. Boys, give us a hand with that bonnet, will you? Oh, give us a hand with that bonnet. Oh, and, uh, Mr. Brown, switch the indictions on when I tell you. Right. All right? Switch on! Oh. Funny. Sid, your petrol gauge reads empty. Yeah, well, it's broken. It always reads empty. <laughs> and how do you know when it is empty? I've got, I've got a, a dipstick here. See, stand back a minute, will you? Stand back, Miss Courtney. You see, this is the petrol here. You put the dipstick in as far as it'll go. That tells you whether it's full up or whether it's empty. There, yeah, it's empty. <laughs> Marvellous. We don't know where we are, and even if we did, we wouldn't be able to get anywhere. Ah, oh, never mind. I'll go find a garage. <laughs> hey, why don't we all have another? Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> well, as well, I suppose, there's no telling how long Sid will be here, Mr. Brown. Oh, have we got Miss Courtney. No, thank you. And I don't think any of you should have a drink either. Oh, come on, Miss C. One little drink won't harm anyone. They have already consumed two of those large cans. What goes in must eventually come out. <laughs> and it could lead to a lot of embarrassment. Squeeze me, please. I'm already wanting to be embarrassing. Well, you will have to wait. Oh, blimey. I shall wait on the coach. Right, right well, come on, gather round, everyone. While we're waiting for Sid, we might as well have a lesson. Ah. So you'll see how it's played. I spy with my little eye something beginning with G. Huh? Gigi! <laughs> Giovanni. No, I'll give you a clue. I'm sitting on it. Bottom! <laughs> no, Max. Gate. Oh, oh, yes. Gate. Hockey. Oh. Right, who's going to go next? Yes, please. Ranjit. I am spying with my little eye. Something beginning with N. N, everyone. Nose? No. 
Nettle. No. Nettle. No. Neck. No. 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 Nail. No. Knitting. You are being stupid. Knitting is not starting with the end. Well done, Ranjit. Right, we give up. Now you tell us what is it that begins with N? Engine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you damn fool! You are being more stupid than I am. You call me stupid, you Pakistani puppet. Oh, right, right, right. Don't you do start again. <laughs> hey, hey, Mr. Brown! I've got some petrol from a little farm over there. Oh. I'll get you there in no time. Right, come on, everyone. Okay. All aboard. <laughs> We are not driving, so we can be drinking. Hey, should we have the first one now? No, we won't have the first one now. Look, please get on the coach, everyone. We can't. Why not? They've only sent one coach. He's caught us in and out, sorting it out. Yeah. What did the man say, Miss Courtney? The man said you only ordered one coach. It's not true. I definitely ordered two coaches. Typical male inefficiency. <laughs> Problem. Yes, where a coach missing. Can't they send one round? They haven't got another one. They're fully booked. What are we going to do? Oh, I, I can get you a coach. Could you, Sid? Yeah, my brother-in-law, he's in the coach business. He lets it out for outings and old age pensioners. I drive for him in my spare.